What's up guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another very exciting episode of Yak Pack Outdoors. And check it out guys, in this episode, Fishing with Norm drove all the way down here to fish with Ryan and me. He came all the way down here from Tallahassee. So uh, I actually am having to redo the intro portion of this video because I did it and like my mic was turned off, whatever it was was messed up. So it just looked like me with no sound. So it was pretty funny. But anyways, so the plan in this video was for Norm and I to go down south to get on some peacock bass, some snakeheads, some cichlids, anything like that. Stuff that Norm usually doesn't get to fish for and doesn't get to catch when he's up in, in Tallahassee. So with that being said, we stopped at Dick's really quick. I picked up a few things to do some peacock fishing with. Norm was filming a different video, which is actually live on his channel right now. So I'm going to link him down below. You guys already know the deal. Uh, Norm's a really good dude. Fished with Norm a while back. Uh, I'm actually going to link another video of where me, Norm, and Lojo fished about I think it was like this past summer. Uh, I'll link that video as well. It was a speed fishing challenge in like these huge lakes in Alabama. It was really, really funny. The loser had to jump in the water. The water had all kinds of crazy, like huge alligators in it. But anyways, guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you do, don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you're new here. And if you have not already, let Yak Pack Outdoors earn your subscription. Go ahead and join the Yak Squad. But without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> all right, this is what we're... We gotta get some uh, some jig heads. You guys already know the deal. When these when, when we're copping these, you guys already know it's peacock fishing time. So we're gonna take this. We're gonna get Norm on some peacocks yes, here in a little sir. bit. Let's do this. All right, guys. Now that we're in here, we've got our uh, peacock jig heads. We've got all the soft plastics that we need down in the truck. So I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and make our way down south and try to get Norm and myself on some quality peacock bass. So with that being said, guys, let's get to fishing. Like okay. Subscribe and hit the yeah, like sure. and subscribe. Your camera's yeah. right here. Yep. Oh yeah, no one with that. <laughs> like and subscribe. <laughs> well, we're gonna get we're gonna get demonetized because they're playing the music right there. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> wow, it's really bright. We're gonna let that auto adjust focus i don't know what it's gonna do maybe we'll just be really bright but norm are you ready to bust them i was born for this moment today yeah <laughs> down south we go we're going peacock fishing yes let's get there so we got to get norm spooled up he's going to use some of this because save him some money on some power pride this sitting in the truck Ooh, colorful line <laughs> norm is gonna we're gonna we're here at the peacock bass spot okay and we're gonna try to catch some peas uh hopefully i hope they're biting what are you doing first? Jerk bait, right? Yeah, jerk bait. Jerk bait. And I've got the the peahawk, the peacock special. Where's it at? There it is, right here. The peacock special. Anyways, I'm gonna put this camera down. Turn the GoPro on. Let's get to fishing. All right, guys. What we're doing right now is uh, we're actually looking for some peacock bass for Norm to catch on a jerk bait. Uh, I've got the little peahawk here. I myself have never caught a peacock on a jerk bait. Uh, I know it can be done. Peacocks love jerk baits. It's just, I don't really like jerk baits, so I don't use them often. But Norm, I think, is gonna capitalize on it. I think he's gonna catch some. We just gotta find them. Just gotta see where they're sitting. Once we do that, I think we'll be golden. Let's go see if Norm's caught anything yet. I haven't seen any peas yet. Well, I wasn't recording for this, but uh, the pea hawk, I saw a cichlid and was like, hey, let's see if I can catch that cichlid. And I just, this dude came up out of nowhere, but not the size we're after, we're after slightly bigger ones. The Peahawk strikes again. I wasn't recording, of course. Of course. Didn't even see him. Oh, you're getting chased. Oh, never mind. He came out of the grass though, so that, that's a good sign. I'm trying to get Norm hooked up on a P. I just gotta find him. The struggle is real. It's kind of cloudy today. I really like when it's sunny so I can see in the water. See where all these peas are hanging out at. All right, we're gonna try to catch this snakehead real quick, guys. Dang, that's tough, man. Shoot. We'll stop back by when we get done fishing what we're gonna fish. We'll make one more stop right here to this corner because the truck's right here. We'll come right back and, and see if you can, oh, right here. Oh, oh dude. Guys, Jack Pack's gonna stick head. <laughs> Woo. 
<laughs> nice, bro. <clears throat> Let's freaking go, dude. He probably bit me out. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> Guys, look at how beautiful these snakehead fish are. Oh my gosh, bro. Nice fish. It's a good one, man. That was super cool. Yeah, that was sick, dude. I, I literally like, I'll, there's another one there, so we're going to come back to it and try to get normal on the second one. But they're basically just fry garden right now. Just like when a bass spawns or anything spawns, they're just guarding their fry. So I'm going to get this dude back. Uh, here in Florida, snakeheads are catch and kill or catch and release. It's the angler's choice, and I choose to catch and release because they're fun fighting fish. So we're going to get some pictures of them. We're going to get them back. All right, so the thing with snake kids is they will they can live out of the water for like for like three days, dude. It's insane. But uh got some pictures of this dude, so we're gonna get him back. He's gonna go right back to his fry. He'll literally slither right back to him. But thanks for the fight. That was freaking awesome. Such a oh god, such an awesome fish to catch. Later. Back right straight, literally look straight back to his fry. That's so crazy, man. All right, that was dope, dude. So one large mouth. One snake head. We're gonna make our way around right now. We're gonna try to get Norm on. I didn't see any peacocks right here. So snake head or peacock. You already got a large mouth, right? Yeah. All right. So you got a large mouth on the... That's a sick one. Let's see how bad he did me. He didn't bend me out like I thought he would. That was awesome. All right. So Norm needs a snake head, cichlid, or peacock. And we're gonna do just that. We're gonna try that right now. We're gonna walk this way. It is so hot out here right now, guys. It's like 90 degrees. My goodness. So we just cranked that one decent sized snake head. And I'm looking, I'm scouting right now for Norm. I know there's gotta be some more largemouth around here. Seeing a lot of cichlids and not enough largemouth and, and peacock. But I just, it's gonna, it's gonna happen. Just gotta be patient. What is that? It's nothing, absolutely nothing. But I made a switch, guys. I made a switch. I was using a 7.6 medium light rod, but I switched my Stratic 3000 to the 6.8 medium and literally 10 times better. So much better. I don't get like those notorious braid knots. It's just so much nicer being able to uh, actually be able to control what I'm what I'm doing and, and what I'm using is a tilapia like crazy right here all kinds of tilapia I don't like tilapia you guys know the deal I hate tilapia I'm actually really really surprised that we didn't see not well we did see one we saw one peacock I saw one when you were over there the other side. okay so two so I'm really surprised because you know two weeks ago when I came here there were eight of them sitting right here all right, guys, that is going to go ahead and wrap this video up. We've got plans to go fish with another person at another spot. Norm's got another video to make. Uh, I also do as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed. What did we catch out here? You caught a bass? Yeah. We saw two peacocks. I caught a snakehead, and I caught another bass, but I, I caught it like when I wasn't recording because, you know, the GoPro Hero 4 really loves to freeze and overheat, but we're not talking about that. That snakehead is really cool, though. That was actually the first snakehead that I've ever caught not on top water. Wow. Every snakehead I've ever caught has been on a frog. And uh, that, that was really cool, actually, and on, on a spinning rod at that. So, anyways, with all that being said, guys, thanks again for watching. My man Norm's going to be linked down in the description below. You know what I'm going to do for him, Norm? I'm going to put the last video that we fished together also as a link down there as well, uh, both yours and mine. So, with all that being said, guys, thank you again for watching. I appreciate all of you. I love all of you. What do they need to do, Norm? Subscribe and hit the bell to join the, the Yak Packers, right? Or the Something Yak Pack like fam? The Yak Gang? Yak I, Squad? I don't know yeah. what your name I don't know what the name is. I don't is. know what my name is either. Look, <laughs> check Norm sometimes. out. Check Norm out, guys. I'm telling you, you're missing out. If you're not looking, if you're not watching Norm's video, you're missing out. Alright, you are missing out. Thanks again for watching, guys. Catch y'all next time.